it has been a very long time since I've done uh, 87s. Uh, but Nick was saying he's going to be racing it, but there's a lot of people we know. Uh, James is in here. Nick's in here. Lee is in here. A lot of others uh, from the uh, the K5 League as well that are running. So we'll see how this one goes for us. I'm going to push the steering ratio up a little more. Bring the brakes to the back. Just one click. I, I don't really know. I This car is such a question mark for me. You have two additional sets of tires for this race. Be smooth and have a good run. You'll have to stop for more fuel before the race is over. The estimated strength of field is 3,409. I think right side the tires are going to be the play, but I don't know. Um, strength of field, 3,400. I am the lowest car in here at a 2,500. Number one car overall is a 6,700. Next time by, you'll be lining up on the inside. Pit road is closed right now. Catch the 16 car. And I was telling Nick beforehand and pretty much everyone that I'm just going to be cruising back here. Not looking to make any moves or anything like that. If I qualified, I would have been starting at P11. Get ready, going green. But we'll see. 90 laps here. The pace car is in. We will need to make a pit stop if we survive the whole way. Green flag, green flag. Car outside. Still there, hold your line. Clear up top. Got one blinker already. And we're just happy to be here. Saving tires is also the name of the game. Sixteen got a little loose. Oh, that's Daniel. Keep high. Clear. He might have caught the uh, the apron a little bit. There's Nick in front of us. Didn't realize Nick was this far back. I knew he had a tough qualifying run, but he's probably just sitting here saving tires. Looks like we can go about 74-ish laps on the tank. I feel like tires are going to be a little more important, though. What we're also going to do... We may not be the first ones to pit. Just because I want to see what people do pit stop lengthwise. Do they take four? Do they take two? I'm going to assume four. Especially if we get a yellow in our window. Thirty-four 
But right now we're just gonna hang out. We're gonna roll. And see what happens. Getting a little racy up there in the middle of the pack. Have fun. Got on the gas a little too hard there. 34.433. The leader just did a 34.641. going to attempt to run the K5 League race tomorrow. Time depending. Car outside. Still there. Still there. Outside is clear. I'm overdriving. If the 15 puts more pressure on us, we're just going to pull over and let him go. That might mean we fall back to last, but... I don't really care all that much. We're only 10 laps in anyway, so... I'm going to be pushing a little too hard here. Big loose there. Yeah, I think the 15 is just overdriving corner entry. Are we entry. just waiting for Nick to drive up here, or...? You get the memo? 35.347. The leader just did a 35.066. There are no wave arounds either in this one. So if you stay out while the leaders pit, you're just going to be in front of the leaders. Single file restarts. But right now, everyone just kind of packed up, minding their P's and Q's. I 
I'm overdriving a bit. And we're just going to learn the car. I do not drive these things often. I just got panhandled. Car inside. Clear. Wait for it to turn. Then get on the gas. Don't turn in gas at the same time. 35.142. One all the way up to the wall. There are going to be three wide exiting. Oh, that was close. They all survived it. Fifteen overdrove as I overdrove. Sorry about that, eighteen. You're good. A little blink out of the guy in front of Nick. Leaders doing 35 second laps. Man, that Hornet is all over the guy in front. 35.008, the leader is running 35.07. And the way he's blinking around, I'm expecting them to get tangled soon. Did not expect that slow down in the middle of the corner. Yeah, I think Nick's backing off because the way the uh, the guy in front of him is blinking. Honestly, I don't blame him one bit. I think I'm sliding the car a little too much through the center. But I will say this has been a ton of fun just trying to learn the car, trying to learn how the dang thing handles.
You have to be incredibly deliberate with this car. Almost annoyingly so. Where you have to sit there and say, all right, car, this is exactly where you're going. This is exactly how much steering input and throttle you're getting. Because otherwise, uh, the car is not going to be happy. Tires really aren't going to be happy. We're all just going to have a bad time if that's the case. Just over a quarter of the way through this one. Technically, we are in our fuel window. That can't be a good sign. Is Nick trying to reverse pit this? Nick typing just a single P. He must be doing one of his crazy strategies because he didn't get loose. Nobody hit him. I don't know why he hit. The car in front is pitting. For the quick. He's reverse pitting this, isn't he? Nick had a 12 second pit stop, so I'm assuming he only took rights. Car outside. Still there, hold your line. Still there, hold your line. Clear up top. Hello. 14 blinking all over the place. Just let Nick go. He's got much better tires. That car is a lap down. 35.409. The leader just did a 35.322.
Nick is running about a second faster than everybody else on clean tires right now. Or fresh tires, rather. 35.428. I feel like I'm overdriving now. I'm going to assume everyone's going to be pitting on lap 45 or thereabouts. Daniel go. Still there inside. Clear inside. Inside. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Stay high. There's a car on the low side. We'll just get the 18 around us as well. Stay high. Clear inside. Part of me is surprised, the other part of me is absolutely nowhere near surprised that this is such a clean race so far. Here he comes. Downside here being, well, to other people, I love this track, but you have to break going into the corners. Oh no. And you actually have to save your tires and not do that. Oh, the horrors. Only a couple of tenths off a liter. Yeah, shifting is not going to work. We'd better not do that. Do we pit early? Maybe lap 40? You know what? Let's do something dumb. Instead of lap 45, like I'm assuming everyone else is, let's come in on lap 40. They're going to have five lap better tires at the end of the run. I'm going to be slow as is, but maybe we'll pick up on something. Watch his lap back. Here he comes. Of 
caught back up with these guys. All right, do we do it? You know what? Let's do it. Let's do something really dumb here, guys. Right sides only. Five, three, two, one. Right here. Let's try this. Just a heads up, you know that you only have one set of right side tires remaining. She do be loose, but tires were 82.79 on the right, 82.86 on the left. There's a wall there. In case you were wondering. Let's see if I'm right. Yep. One coming down pit road now. There's a wall again. Alright, so we picked up one spot from pitting early. And we gained 10 seconds on him. curious to see if Nick's plan works. He pitted on lap 25. That is going to be a, uh, a must watch video for me when he puts that one out. Hopefully it's tomorrow morning so I could watch it while I'm working. Slow on the front stretch. Don't know if the 11 missed his pit or what had happened. The leader just 
They get inside going into three here, James. You too, Dante. Yeah, Daniel's faster than me on the straights. I'm just better than him in the corners. Only because I have new tires. The car behind is pitting. Car inside. Still there, inside. Stay high. Clear inside. Roll the top with new tires. This might be one of those things for every lapped car that I pass is going to be a spot when they pit, hopefully. One more heading down pit road. Let's see where the 14 comes out. Everyone else took uh, took four. Inside. Still inside. Stay high to the car on the low side. The car in P18. Just set the fastest lap. 33.855. Clear inside. If a yellow comes out and we get back on the lead lap. I am a thousand percent coming down pit road to change all four. We did get around the fourteen. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I had a sneeze enter in the braking zone, and I completely ruined my race. Oh, that sucks. I feel like we've all been there at one point or another. What? 35.075. The sneeze of destruction. Definitely all been there before if we're doing that. I got the mega death song. <laughs> What a great song. The leader is running 35.398. 35.059. Oh, I'm overdriving. All because I needed a stupid drink of stupid water. Stupid hydration. Catching the other Nick, who's in the K5 league. Pitting this time, Tyler. I'm pitting this time. I gotcha. More folks are pitting. Who painted these walls blue? Brainy, sir. It is very hard to see these walls.
Jeez. The car in front is pitting. This will be the fight, but Lee is going to have a much better run. He's on brand new tires. I'm on 18 lap old tires. Now is when the uh, two versus four crowd is going to show up. Two tires will probably throw them ahead of me. Four throws them behind me. Maybe. You're gaining on the car in front. The gap is 1.5 seconds. Boxing is fine. The leader is running. I thought he was. These two fighting it out next to each other. Inside. Clear inside. <laughs> That's on me for not paying attention. All right, we are getting around the 18. And the nine here, just barely. He's got fresh tires. Part of me is kind of regretting that two tire move. I thought they were going to collect or connect. In fairness, the dude has like a million lap fresher tires than me, so easy there, crew chief.
25 to go at the line. 65 down already. Those two in front of me have much older tires. Or much newer tires, rather. Okay, we did get around the 12. The lead is fitting now. But will he be fast enough to actually catch up with me? Barring any issues. I think tires are gonna... I think the tires are gonna even out a bit. Aside from the initial shock. Couple of side by side races up ahead. James in the thick of it. The car in front is pitting. 35.158 I would say can we catch James but He's got some 30-odd lap fresher tires. the 12 other Nick Still there, hold your 
Clear. Just gonna let these guys go. Billy to the point. From the K5 League. There you are. You know, we're having a fairly decent run. Oh, we're overdriving. Too much gas on the back end. Caution right now would be fantastic. Bolt on a new set of tires and call it a day. Somebody got spun. Looked like Nick. Take the bottom. Okay. The heck was that about? That was weird. in P13. The leader is running 34.879. Oh Jesus, overdriving. what I get for looking at my watch. Who knows, maybe we'll all even out. Ten to go. When you guys catch me, I'm going to take the very top. Let y'all go by. By the way, my uh, 
podcast co-host is on vacation, Thank so you, that's why I'm racing on a Wednesday night. Normally, I'm not. Don't give them any room. You're supposed to crash them. No, I wasn't on fresher tires. It's only when you're on fresher tires, you're allowed to wreck the leader. Normally, uh, Wednesday nights, I do my Texas podcast Earth. here on YouTube and on Twitch, Tabletop Trio. All one word. On Twitch, anyway. Talk about hobbies, the people that enjoy them. And anything's a hobby, whether it's journalism, radio, you know, in my the case. The racing complaint department really loves it. Sim racing, board games and Jump such. Dirtily. They're never going to employ. All the fun stuff. But that's on Wednesdays. I know you didn't sign up for an ad read, but would be pretty awesome if you checked it out. Plus, if you've, you know, if you're one of those people that's like, oh, man, I wonder what this person looks like. You can check out the podcast. Ah, damn it. I got an angry Floridian chasing me down. I don't think I have enough time. Two, uh, two folks that I've interacted with a lot here in iRacing, fighting with one another between Lee and uh, James. By the way, if you like what you see, would love to, uh, you know, let me know in the comments. Like the video, subscribe to the channel here getting closer and closer to 900 subs, which is just ridiculous. Things are looking good. Like to hit the, the thousand mark by the end of the year. Got a couple ideas for those. But we just hit four to go. As the th this thing steps out from underneath of itself. P14, we're going to lose some I rating, but that's okay. Hopefully we'll grab some more safety rating. I mean, we're at zero incidents, so barring anything catastrophic. And at this point, I just want to have this one end. Leader gets the two. It's going to be close. Is the 11 going to have enough to get around the 13? That's the big question. As so we get the white flag. White flag, white flag. One more to go. Well, Kale gets the win. Need like one more lap. Good race. 
No 90 shots, green, so well hell yeah. Guy. Yeah, caution free is great, like always. Yeah, great job, guys. That was awesome. Even with his uh, on, weird strategy, back. still scores a top 10. Bring it back to the pits, we're going. Y'all do fuel only. Two tires. We'll drive it back to the pits. Yeah, I did fuel also. Just to get that extra lap of safety rating. You take five, Dante. Or sorry, four. <laughs> All right, we'll park it here. And we'll take a look at all the wall hits because that's literally all it was. All right, let's take a look. First one is the seven. We'll, we'll tap from the, the 13. Fifteen drives it in deep, snags the wall. Here's the nine. No, not sure why it's shown us that. That was it. And now the one's gonna do his donuts. Good run. Let's take a look at what happened. That's what we like to see. So we, uh, we lose 16 I rating. Oh, well, we gained 27 safety rating, just almost back up to that 4.0. Thanks for watching. That was fun.